Hello out there. I woke up this morning with a beetle haircut. How about that? Ooh, oh yeah, I feel right at home in this. Anyhow, I thought today I would show you my collection of Beatles movies. Won't that be fun, boys and girls? Oh yeah, I think so too. So, let's begin because this might take a while, alright? So, anyhow, let's start with A Hard Day's Night. Yeah, I know you guys are going to say, oh, I've seen that before, but, but we got help next. Ooh, yeah. I believe these are the two DVD versions. I also have Magical Mystery Tour. Okay. And I've got Yellow Submarine. Cool, huh? We've got Let It Be. Oh, but don't get too uh, impressed because it's a fake. This year the real one hopefully should be coming out, so I'll be getting that to replace it. So that's just a, a, a placeholder, okay? All right, where do we go from here? Let's, let's jump to the anthology. Yeah, there they are. Don't leave home without it. Now we got the... Uh, a fake anthology. Where'd it go? I thought I was prepared. Oh, there it is. This, the Beatles' A Long and Winding Road. It's like a four-disc set. Uh, they tried to beat the anthology at their own game. This came out uh, just just shortly before the real one did. See, and they even copped the title along the winding road before they changed it to anthology and that same company at the same time put one out for the Rolling Stones so hey everybody got a shot they weren't taking any chances uh, in case all right so speaking of documentaries we also have the complete Beatles which was probably the go-to documentary before anthology came out Oh, let's just grab a handful here. So we, then, then we get into uh, the ones made by other companies and stuff. Although this one was an Apple one. This is Beatles, the first the U.S. visit. And then the Beatles parting ways. A lot of these you can find in the in the uh, discount section. Yeah, Beatles diary. Is this one with Elf Bicknell? Yeah. Alf Bicknell, he'll show you around Liverpool and show you where the Beatles used to hang out. The Beatles celebration? Yeah, whatever. Okay, whatever. And I'm sure most of you have seen Fun with the Fab Four. Yeah. And another sort of documentary, The Beatles Unauthorized. The Beatles mini documentaries, so they uh, covered all their albums when they came out. This, this I think, was a special feature on uh, on uh, the CDs when they came out, I believe. All right. Let's see, we've got one plus, so it's got two DVDs of uh, basically music videos by the Beatles. Yeah. And who could forget the Ron Howard film, Eight Days a Week? Two DVD version, because they had a lot of stuff to uh, show you. Okay, kind of getting into some gray areas here. We've got all the cartoons in various stages of, uh, of condition. Okay, grab another handful here. We've got uh, Lennon... NYC. I haven't watched that in a while. I forget what that's about. It must be a documentary, I guess. Whatever. Everyone should have the two Ruddles movies. Yeah. Okay. I've got uh, 
Oh, yeah. <laughs> what was it again? Birth of the Beatles, that uh, Dick Clark documentary movie from way back. Yeah. Got that. Oh, yeah. I got Broad Street. Whoopee. Whoopee, whoopee. Um, we've got to imagine John Lennon. Yeah. And, uh, give me some truth. Oh, Blu-ray, yes. And a couple things that, uh, are more Beatles related, such as the I Want to Hold Your Hand. That is such a fun movie. That'd... You up there, get down from there. You mean me, Ed? Yeah, you, Ed. And, uh, Two of Us, which was the movie that kind of documented Paul and John having a, uh, a, me a meeting one day in New York. Okay? <laughs> so, anyway, aside from that and a few uh, loose things like some Ed Sullivan uh, performances that I haven't even gone through yet. Hey, that's all my Beatles movies that I've got for right now. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. I got my mind set on you. I got my